welcome back to another video. So I'm currently in Taipei, Taiwan, and today we're gonna do full day eating at only 7-Eleven. So let's go. First 7-Eleven is actually a five minute walk away from our hotel. And we're just gonna look for other 7-Elevens throughout the day. And Hopefully. see if there's differences. Yeah. But I don't think there is, to be honest. I don't think so either. Yeah, so. but I'm gonna just eat whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm currently squatting outside with 7-Eleven. And I was looking at Google and there's actually Hello Kitty themed 7-Eleven. There's a Snoopy one. So I definitely want to go to the Hello Kitty and Snoopy one. But everything else, I'm just gonna wing it. Because there's just like actually so many. There's like three on like every two blocks. This is the tea eggs and it's looking real delicious. But I am not really an egg person. Ooh. So I'm gonna skip on that. Oh, that looks so good. Guys, nice. these like fish balls? They're like, yeah, fish balls. So this area has all of those microwavable food. We have some rice dish over here. This is a pork and egg fried rice. We also have like curry, pasta. Oh my gosh, and these like sandwiches that I see on like the Japanese 7-Eleven vlogs. Because it is only morning and it's 6 a.m. I am gonna get myself a coffee. Just like a whole entire selection of drinks. They have like juices, milk, coffee. Hmm, what should I get? I've decided to go with this coffee and it's $25 Thai B. Okay, so I just got back to the hotel. I'm gonna try this rice ball with salmon and little like fish ball, like fish rolls. I also got this coffee. Let's try this one first actually. Ooh. Mmm. It's like perfectly sweet. And the coffee is like not too strong, but you can definitely taste it. And it's not too milky either. Wow. My friend got another drink but we're sharing so I'm just gonna show it to you guys this is um a milk tea um I mean it's not bad but it's definitely not the best let's try the race ball really quickly so you open it from here you can definitely tell that they did not cheap out on the fish like there is a good amount in here Ooh. Alright, first bite. Mmm. The rice is cooked perfectly. Mmm. And the fish in the middle is not too overly powerful. Mmm. It's a really good balance. Wow. The rice is so bouncy and chewy. Full of flavor but not too overpowering salty and the fish is like oh, it's just perfect together I'm gonna try this ramen it is a beef noodle ramen what is this it looks so good and there's like little chunks of meat and this looks like fresh meat guys like it does not look like meat from a ramen package I'm just gonna let the ramen sit here for a little bit this is the item that I'm most excited about. Ooh. So um, one side is crawfish and the other side is an egg salad. Look at how bouncy this bread is. Mmm. What the? Bro. This is busting on a whole nother level. The egg is so soft and this crawfish full of flavor oh my god like the bread is so soft i don't know how they keep it so soft even though it's <laughs> hmm? like, i'm not even joking i've never had it's so good you're tearing up <laughs> <laughs> i've never had a sandwich that's like that good especially from 7-eleven i feel like a bacon egg and cheese can't even top that exactly i would choose this over a bacon egg and cheese i would choose this over a mcchicken period the crawfish part 
you can actually tell this crawfish inside it's not something cheap like you can see there's like bits and pieces of crawfish like if you can tell from here you see the little bits and pieces of crawfish yeah they are definitely not cheaping out next is this tofu thing so you pick out which one you want each one is a different price and is marinated in this soup i love stuff like this Mm. Okay, the marinade is good, but this fish ball or this fish tempura thingy tastes like it's, well, it feels like it's been there for a while. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's like not, hard, like mm, stale. It's like soggy. Oh. I don't know how to explain Maybe it. Maybe because it's marinated too much. Yeah. Maybe don't get the long one that I just showed you. And this is a flat circle one. Mmm. This is really good. Mmm. Oh, I didn't even see that. There's like mushroom and carrots in the middle. This one is not soggy at all. Last but definitely not least is my most favorite thing in the world. Tofu marinated in the soup. Mmm. Wow. The tofu sucks up all the soup. When you bite into it, all the soup just like <clears throat> bursts in your mouth. Mmm. And this soup itself is so flavorful. Mmm. So freaking good. Hopefully the ramen is done now. Let's see. You can't oh. tell me this is ramen meat. That was inside the ramen? Yeah. Oh, okay. Like, this meat looks like I literally just grilled it. A real test. Wow. The meat is so tender. If you didn't tell me this was from a ramen, I would think somebody just made the meat. And the noodles are so bouncy. And you, you can't even tell it's ramen. Oh, my God. Oh, this looks fire. Mmm. This soup. It's like a spicy and sour flavor. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take my rice ball and I'm gonna dip it in the soup. Oh. Ooh. Mm. Is good? Oh shit. So I just threw my whole entire rice ball in and I'm gonna make a rice ramen combo bite. Oh, that sounds fire. <laughs> Come away. Mmm. The rice just soaked up all the soup. Mmm. Mm. Breakfast completed. So it is currently lunchtime and I am at another 7-Eleven right now. I do not know what I want. I'm actually really feeling this vegetable fruit juice thing. So I'm gonna grab this. Deciding if I should get this Nyoromia, which is beef noodle soup or if I should get this garlic sausage pork bento with rice eggs and bean sprout I am very intrigued by this popcorn chicken because I don't know how crispy is gonna be as for not least I am also getting this seafood with cream sauce sandwich this looks super busted this is the sandwich from before they actually take out the packaging for you and look at how cute this is this is kind of like a panini. Oh. Wow, this looks fire. So it has shrimp, cheese, and corn. Mm. Yes, I really don't understand how the shrimp, like the meat inside, is still so fresh and soft. Look at the filling, guys. Look at this shrimp. Like, it does... You can't... Like, you cannot tell me this was frozen or, like, it was packaged. What the... I love stuff like this. I don't know why. Other people find it weird, but it's pretty good to me. So, it's mixed fruits, vegetables, and I forgot to get a straw, so I'm just gonna open the old school way. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, it looks like this. 
it's super refreshing and it tastes mostly like carrots and parsley. Mm. And apples. And pineapples. This is really, really good. This is like the perfect healthy drink if you're not a healthy person. Because personally, I don't eat vegetables like that. So this juice is perfect for me. Last but absolutely not least, I have the bento box. Look at that sausage. It looks so good. Pork slice. Mm -mm. We have some eggs, some cabbage, and some bean sprouts over here. Let's try the sausage. Mm. It's sweet. It's savory. It has that pop. Oof. This rice is looking so good. Mmm. Okay, I don't know what race Taiwanese people use, but it's so bouncy. What the hell? I'm going to do a rice ooh, combo bite with some cabbage and some bean sprouts. Cheers. Mmm. How is it? Pretty it's busting, right? Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna try this juicy looking piece of pork. Ooh. Busting. Mmm. If I lived in Taiwan, I would go to 7 Eleven every day to get lunch. It's affordable, it's freaking delicious. Mmm. I am. It's convenient. Guys, if you just gave me this, I really will never ever be able to tell that this was from a packaged meal. I'm gonna throw in the popcorn chicken and eat it with some rice and veggies. Ooh. Look at this bite. Bust to a whole nother level of busting. <sighs> I'm officially so full now, so I'll see you guys at dinner. It's finally time for dinner and we took the train for half an hour to come to the Hello Kitty 7-Eleven. This is the one that I'm most excited about because I love Hello Kitty, like love Hello Kitty so much since I was a kid. And here we are and it's so cute! <gasps> OMG! Okay, time to go in. Because we aren't that hungry yet, we're actually just gonna each pick one item and just share everything. Because, yeah, I feel like I've been eating too much this whole entire day. So the chicken corn soup was actually a powder and you put some hot water inside and it looks like this afterwards. It smells so good. These are the items that we picked out. This over here is what I picked out, which is this spear rib thing. Dude, look at that glaze on that. This is a vegan mushroom dish that my girl Helen picked out. Yep. Cream katsu, what is this? Curry. Damn, look at that. That muffin over here picked out. <laughs> this corn soup was picked up by this mysterious person over here. And I had to choose out this bonus hot dog. I can't get enough of is that this. Is spicy one? <laughs> this is a three cheese. But you don't taste the cheese. It's oh. really good. Okay, okay, okay. Boom, boom. So for um, hot dogs at 7-Eleven, you have to either go really early or you don't get it because they do not restock but I think for this Hello Kitty one maybe they didn't sell out today but now you know if you want this hot dog you gotta come early thing I'm gonna do is try this soup mm. how is it? Mm. fire fire? oh yo this soup is so good the flavor is so good in this mm. like I would never think it's instant soup guys the soup is a must try for sure so this is the vegan dish that my friend got 
need that curry. Mmm, fire. This is the kelp that's inside the vegan dish. Mmm. Mm. Well, it's so like guac guac. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and this is the bamboo shoot. Mmm. I don't know how they make it this fresh. And it's and like. And it's still in the packages. Yeah. Mm. Here, this for you. Put your combo bite on. Oh, okay. This is really the Ooh, curry chicken with so white good. sauce. And I'm gonna make it a combo bite. Like barbecue mm. with honey. Ooh. This is really good. It's so flavorful and saucy, which mm. I love. Yo, the Korean that's not good for no reason. This is the katsu that's inside the rice. And look at how juicy this chicken is. This is half curry, Veggies half white sauce. Right now. Let's try the curry yeah. first. Really? Yeah. Wow. Picky eaters. The curry rem reminds me of Udon West by St. Mark's. Mm, my favorite curry spot. More Japanese restaurant. The corn, uh, chicken corn soup. Yo, the waist sauce is so good. Now time for the chicken. Mmm. The chicken katsu is so juicy. Huh? The seasoning is so good. This is what I'm the most excited about. Spear ribs. No way you said This spear rib is okay. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like the sauce. For, for, mm. for a, like a box like this? I, I, just, okay. I just think the sauce is not good, but the meat is very tender and it's really mm. good. But I don't like the sauce. So that's enough for me. It's time for my infamous sausage. I love relish, so I'm just gonna squeeze it right on top of here. The ketchup. Tell me this does not look fire. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Listen to this pop, guys. No pop. Haha, <laughs> never mind. Oh, if you guys look at the inside, there's some cheese. Wow.